<laughs> this is a much better designed area. <laughs> you know what? I gotta see that. Wait, did that hurt me? That hurt me, didn't it? Uh, unless I already had damage marked on me. Let's eat something. And then we're gonna see. Did that hurt me? No, okay. It, but the fact that it doesn't hurt me is hilarious. Because that means I can just keep doing it. Hey, buddy. Watch this. <laughs> That's so cool. That is so cool. Yeah, this area is so much more interesting than the Great Plateau ever was. The Great Plateau was this, like... Uh, at the end of the day... Breath of the Wild, how I view it, it is the best tech demo I have ever played. But at the end of the day, it means it is just a tech demo. There's nothing... Oh. It... There's a lot of emptiness to Breath of the Wild, a lot of stuff that just doesn't have a purpose at all. And I like the fact that in this, there are so many moving parts to what we've experienced. Again, Breath of the Wild, five minutes into the game, you basically have all the components of the game. Sword combat, shield combat, two-handed weapon combat, spear combat. You're done. You have your, your bombs, which are not useful for much of anything. They're, it's very obvious where you'd use your bomb. Um, Cryonis is pretty obvious as well. Uh, interesting that they give me these pieces. It's very cut and dry. But in this game, they're like, hey, here are a bunch of tools. Start developing your playstyle, because over time, you're going to have to do that. Got him. What is... Is that just a chest? Is that, like, just a chest I can get my hand on? Yep. Just like Magnesis. Unchanged. Amber. Yep. So I could fuse um, Amber with my weapons too, and it looks like it gives quite the attack power bump. Uh, I want to drop this, and I want to take the stick, and honestly, let's, let's give this a shot. So I need to... That's one thing I don't like. I can't, like, fuse this from here. I have to go here. Like, it's not the end of the world. It's just a little bit annoying. And then I need to equip. And then use with my wooden stick. And now I have, like, a wooden dagger. That's kind of sweet. Uh, now I'm going to start taking damage. So let's fix that. Actually, let's do a tech I learned in Breath of the Wild. I mean, it's not really a tech. It's just waiting for me to have only a couple hearts left. And then using my, my gear or my food. Uh... I just got in a. I have just gotten in a circle. So there, that's basically all there is here. So let's let's run up here. I am still mixing it up a little bit, but I am liking the fact that uh, I am liking how I moved. I moved attack to B. It feels natural. Um, I like being able to run, jump easily, or attack easily. That's kind of neat. Uh. Okay, so let's let's do this. Alright. I can't climb that. Which is kinda cool, because again, in Breath of the Wild, you could just climb glash. And you can't climb glash in this game. Also, I guess that water would probably instantly kill me. We're close to it. So ultimately I need to get up there. How do I go about doing that? Game Design 101, they put this little crack here as a way for you to put this here and walk up. Kind of, kind of walk up. Climb up. That's a new animation. And we're up. That is Game Design 101, saw it a mile away, never doubted myself. Hello. I'm going to switch to this little app. This little app. Oh, it's badly damaged. That's not cool. Uh, what's in there? What is in there? <laughs> that will not get That won't get old for a while. Just some garbage. Probably some arrows. Ooh, amber. I'm fine. I'm okay. Move it closer. Closer. 
rotate, drop. I probably could have separated some of that. I'm okay. And now I'm up here. What is up here? Another dispenser? Way over there? Cool. I have a feeling... I'm gonna go over there in a second. There's a lot over there that I can I can use, but right here I have a I have a shrine. So let's go into the shrine. Also, I'm looking out down at my recording and I'm at three hours and fifty-five minutes. Undoubtedly, I'm at like episode seven or eight now. And this is just the first session. I have yet to uh I have yet to stop recording and edit all this so this is all one session so if you said some stuff that i'm missing that's very obvious i apologize um i will i'm going to stop recording as soon as i leave the island oh so you've made it here now then extend your right hand i will grant you the power of I will grant you the power of eating glass. Please use it wisely. What did I get? Is it somewhat similar to eating glass? That oddly specific thing that you should never do? Ascend! Yeah, this is it's the same mm. thing. Uh, this is the ascend ability. It lets you travel through what's directly above you to ascend through it and emerge on top of it. You'll find it quite useful in all sorts of places and situations. Mm. Use Ascend and receive the blessing from this shrine. Alright, Ascend. The ability to rise. Wrong button. Ascend. Aptly on up. And aim the camera up. Press A. Trippy, man. Oh, you could use this as like a stealth thing too. Huh, now what happens if I use it and there's nothing above me? Excellent. No way. Oh, okay, there's actually no way. Got it. There has to be something directly above me and then I could use it. I knew that there'd be a chest here. What's in there? Stone axe. Um. Yeah, get out of here. Will I take fall damage? No, I'm good. So I can go up here. Uh, this is one of the things that I was I was really wondering. Okay. Um. Oh, it freezes time. That's kind of cool. I really don't want to use this shield. And I. Um, that's one of the things I was kind of I was kind of wondering because climbing Breath of the Wild was it was all right. Um, one of the things I really wasn't a fan of, and I kind of see that they brought back in this game was the ability that you can just climb basically glass, and I've alluded to it a couple times. You can climb glass. I don't know if I wanted. Oh, I did want to do that because now I can just. Do that. Um, <clears throat> and so that makes exploration, that makes exploration, um, kind of trivial, trivialized. Um, the best part of Breath of the Wild, as I've alluded to, uh, as I said earlier, is like the first 12, 15 hours of the game. When you don't have all the stamina in the world, you don't have climbing gear, um, you have to plan out climbs, uh, er everything is lethal to you. Every bit of gear matters, as we're experiencing in the game right now. But... And once you get past that, you look at a mountain and you're like, oh, I'll just climb over that. Or I'll just use Revali's Gale over it. And it kind of trivializes it. Here, they, they force you... They force you to wait for something to, uh, to come above you. And then you have to be able to swim through it. Um, it might have a certain, like... There we go. 
Um, it might have a certain, like, thickness requirement, I don't know. But there are obviously restrictions to this ability, right? As opposed to... Hold up. I got that right? Yeah, I did. Uh... As opposed to some of the other things that we we had in Breath of the Wild, other tools that we had. I'm always gonna run around this. It's just like Breath of the Wild, you never know. And now I have another orb. And we're out. Oh, I thought I thought he was actually gonna start speaking. My bad. Ah. Uh, I see you've restored some power to that new arm of yours. Mm. The door to the Temple of Time should now open for you. I thought he was going to give me the sailcloth, but I was sadly mistaken. And now this thing has despawned, and I can't get back up here. Uh, I really want to get over there. Oh man. Uh, okay. Um, I have a couple things to do here. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I don't need to do that. I don't need to do that. I have a new ability. And there's something conveniently right above me. I was making a whole, like, ladder, but all I need to do is... Ascend! Hi, bud. Uh, you know what? I need to go hard and fast. I need to stop him from using this. Uh, bo, 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 bo. And let's use, um. I really don't want to be using these every fight. Let's use this. Freeze you. Freeze you. And then let's oh, let's kill. Uh, actually, let's use this. Kill him. Oh. Kill him. Ow! You still have a hit left. You still have a hit left. Not used to how many points these things have. Okay, you're still there. I have a moment to collect my thoughts. And honestly, honestly, this seems like a pretty good combo. Die. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, there are a bunch of fire things here. Ooh. I really wish I hadn't fused a bunch of garbage with my shields. Let's do one of these. <sighs> Shovel down some food. Uh, and then we're going to... Oh man, I'm starting to... I'm starting to get to that point. Um... I could use a hammer, honestly. Let's get rid of this. Drop. What happens if I fuse this... Huh. This is kind of disposable, right? Wow, that went far. What? Okay. Uh, let's... Let's try this. <laughs> what does this do? Yeah, that's what I thought. That's sweet. Okay. Now what's in here? Something cool? Eh, opal. Whatever. I, I should start using the gems. I should start sh I should start trying those out. Uh, is there anything else? I really wish I hadn't fused garbage to my shields. <sighs> Fine. Uh oh. <laughs> uh, that's not good. That is the opposite of good. Um. <sighs> That's kind of an emergency. I need to run. I'm going to die of cold. Let's not do that. Run, 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 run. Oh, I used my stamina. Drop, 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 drop. Where on earth? Where on earth? Where on earth was the ability to cook food? Oh, it was up there. No. Uh, I don't have the ability to use send here. There's no shot I'd be able to use it there. 
Uh, quickly, quickly, quickly. Stone axe. Why is B? Why is B? Uh, yes, 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 yes. Eat more shrooms. Um, no, 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 no. This. Quickly, 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 quickly. I don't need as many as I did last time, as I used last time. That should... Uh, this Quickly. Oh, that's not good. I mean, I can heal. It's not the end of the world, but... I messed that up royally. Come on. Uh, it's a little bit clunky. Drop. And eat something else. Uh, I need to cook food fast, or else I'm just going to start churning through my resources. That is not good. I thought I could have sworn I had one more. Uh, fire, 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 fire. Uh, weapon, weapon, weapon. Sure, just quickly. And, okay. Pressure's off. Let's fix my mistake. This looks delicious, by the way. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're fine. Let's do some cooking. Of a gotcha machine. Uh, also, why did I not eat this? Wait, what was in this? I totally forgot. I, I was kind of in a rush. What was in this? <clears throat> um. Listen. <laughs> listen here. I, I haven't had a chance to look at the comments. I know, I, I know what they're going to say, and I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear your sass. <laughs> uh, I, let's, moving on. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Draw distance hello. Uh, it's fine. It's okay. It's okay. That. <laughs> uh. Hey, Roru. Hi, bud. Are you, you look kind of mm. sad. The Zonai devices were a pinnacle. Were the pinnacle of our technology. We built an advanced civilization with them, and flourished for many, many years. Oh. If you can master the use of the Zonai devices. Your quest will be much easier. Uh, long time viewers, if there are any of you left, will, will have probably noticed that I have a couple of different voices in my employ than I did before. Uh, one of the things I've been up to, um, up to the most, that sounds grammatically wrong, but I don't think it is. Uh, I, one of the things I've taken to in the years that I haven't been Let's Playing, I can't, I'm so sad to say that it's been years, um, has been, I keep doing that, has been playing Dungeons and Dragons. And in the process, granted, m keep in mind my voice is kind of shot from having done four hour, a four hour recording session when I'm not used to it. Uh, you can kind of hear it in my voice right now. But one of my passions has been Dungeons and Dragons. And in the process, uh, I initially I took to D and D because I, I did so many different voices uh, in in uh, for the channel. But over the course of playing, I've realized that I there's so much so many different facets. I guess um, I'm gonna address that in a second. There are so many different parts of my my vocal range that I had never ever explored. And I got the chance to do that with D&D. &D. Um, and, and so, <clears throat> when it comes to doing voices like this, it comes naturally to me. In fact, I could do this voice just as much as I do my normal voice. And 
that's kind of neat. It's kind of neat to come back to the channel with that in my employ. Uh, there are some channels, or some channels, there are some voices that I, I had that um, I developed further. For example, my, um, my Flint, cr my Flint Cragley voice. Um, and there are other voices. <clears throat> there, there are other voices like this. Which I can't really do while my voice is shot. Um, that I've gotten a lot better at. So uh, it's kind of neat to return to Let's Playing with that in my employ because that's something I, I always enjoyed uh, while Let's Playing was playing different characters and and honing my voice. Uh, sure, you could probably say that I like to hear myself talk a little bit too much, but eh, everybody has their flaws. My maintenance duties are complete for today. It has been another cycle with no visitors. And then, of course, there's this voice, which I love to bring out. Oh, this is a rarity. It is unusual for me to receive visitors here, perhaps because I am on an island floating in the sky. I assume you will require Zonai devices to descend the mountain. Would you like to use the device dispenser? Uh, yes. I am manufacturing Zonai devices with using this device dispenser. If you see the bowl-like receptacle, resources held in your hands can be deposited here. We went through this before. I have nothing new except for the fact that I am giving you wing devices, which I will talk about right now. And by I, I mean pal. Let us use this. And skip, 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 skip. I don't need to see this. Alright, let's see how many new things. A wing, obviously, flame emitters, fans, 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 wings, 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 nothing new. Other than the wings. So, wings! How do these work? Alright. Let's jump down there because I assume we're going to get a tutorial? Actually, it almost looks like this is supposed to... Oh, I know it's supposed to happen. Um... Am I supposed to use fans here? Am I supposed to attach fans? Fans to the top? Here, give me a sec. Um, oh, you know what? They're wings. Probably to the back, right? So, let's organize this. All the way to... Move all the way to the, to the right. I haven't used this yet. I... Oh, man. I'm dumb. I'm doubly dumb. We're not going to talk about that. I'm going to just drop two of them. That's funny. Uh... So now, I need to use this. Okay, real quick, real quick, I want to talk about this. One of my my skills is recognizing uh, sound effects that are shared between uh, media. Shut up. Um, <clears throat> and this is one of them. Listen, listen closely to the sound effect. Uh, Future Pal, if you can, I, I know you're kind of a garbage at editing. Also, I didn't even think to say future pal. I just said it. It's that com it's coming back to me, guys. Uh, make the sound effect louder. Is that not from Luigi's Mansion 3? It. I'm pretty sure it is. I, I have an ear for this. I don't know if this is correct. I don't know if this is correct. Wait, I can just climb the tree. Give me a second. Give me a second. I can ascend this tree. One moment. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. I have a sense for it. I remember every Korok seed in Breath of the Wild. And I... Hate it. Hello. My... Arch Nemesis 907. <sighs> I'm gonna die. I'm fine. That hurt a lot. That hurt a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. No, stop moving. I think this is correct, guys. The bird men are coming. Let's go. Oh, it's a. Maybe I don't even need that. Okay, maybe I don't need the engine. The Birdmen are coming. 
Here we go. 